this is the most requested video on this channel. Amazon milk frogs have nothing to do with the company, but where they're from. The Amazon Forest. Amazon milk frogs are natively found in South America, in Colombia, Bolivia, Brazil, Peru, and Venezuela. This arboreal frog species spends most of its life close to slow moving water, high up in the humid tropical rainforest canopy. Amazon milk frogs generally have bumpy speckled skin that is white, tan, light brown, or taupe with black and brown patterns. They also have a blue-toned mouth and toes. They have large sticky toe pads to help them climb and can grow anywhere between two and four inches, making them some of the largest frogs in South America. Like most frog species, they are nocturnal, so they come out at night to hunt and eat bugs. They have few natural predators because of their poison, although it's generally not dangerous to humans. Amazon milk frogs can live up to 25 years in captivity when they're well cared for. And guess what? They have a ton of names. They are known as Amazon milk frogs because of the milky substance that they can secrete on their skin. They're also known as the Mission Golden Eye Tree Frog for the black cross shape in their golden eyes. The Blue Milk Frog because of the blue coloring of their mouth and feet. They're also known as boatman frogs because their call sounds like oars against the sides of a canoe. I won't be pronouncing their Latin name, but it refers to their pointy snout that they use to push through branches and leaves in the forest. I don't have a pet frog, so I'm not a pet frog specialist, but I know that these frogs are commonly kept as pets. So here are some common sense tips. Make sure these frogs have enough humidity in their enclosure and that it is always kept clean. This can help them live a much longer time. These frogs require a lot of humidity because of their native habitat. Don't be surprised if your frog sheds and eats its skin. This is actually very common among many frog species, including the Amazon milk frog. Males are smaller than females and they make mating calls between May and November. During this time, they also develop larger thumbs and always wear gloves when handling them because the oils, dirt, and soap residue on our skin is terrible for frogs. That's because they breathe and drink through their skin. Check out this video to learn more about other kinds of frogs.